Veterans Day is Monday, and for some vets in Northeast Ohio dealing with hunger, homelessness, or a disability, it can be difficult to find out what benefits are out there for those who served. News 5's Olivia Fecto shows us how the VA and others are helping get vets connected. Jeffrey Archibald served three years in the U.S. Army. I was in from 1996 to 1999. He came to today's Veterans Resource Fair in Massillon after learning he could get a veteran's ID card. I thought that was only for people who uh, were disabled or retired. He's used other veterans' benefits in the past. I took out a VA home loan and that worked out great. And then I did receive the GI Bill with the kicker benefits. But he didn't know he was eligible for other services until today. The fair brought together dozens of organizations, bringing resources directly to the veterans. It's one of about five larger fairs and nearly 200 smaller fairs the VA of Northeast Ohio and other organizations put on each year. I believe that there's literally nothing we can do that could possibly repay the sacrifice that our veterans have made for us. For U.S. Congressman Anthony Gonzalez, events and outreach are important to help veterans and show appreciation for their service and sacrifice. Some have you know, minor issues uh, as much as just getting a bill paid by the VA, but then it goes all the way down to some really serious things around mental illness and, and, uh, and homelessness. One problem many veterans struggle with is hunger. That's why the SAM Center here in Maslin and other community groups put together these emergency food bags filled with a three-day supply to make sure veterans get enough to eat. The SAM Center, serving area military veterans, was founded by Brian Bowman. He served 21 years in the Army and Army National Guard. I thought that we could do more for veterans. The center offers a free commissary with food and toiletries for veterans in need, but that's not its only purpose. We get them to come in and we're able to talk to them about, are you signed up for VA health care? Are you signed up for compensation? Every veteran's problems are going to be individual. Kristen Parker with the VA Northeast Ohio Healthcare Care System says these fairs let veterans know what benefits are available. It's important. It's something that they earned and it's something that they deserve. Jeffrey Archibald says he's glad he came out to the fair. I couldn't even believe how helpful it was. So uh, if anyone has the opportunity to come out, they definitely should. In Stark County, Olivia Fecto, News 5.